Hello, hello guys and welcome back. We are in Transport Beaver of course and we are in our city in Norway, Tau. Running along the line of one of the bus lines. Actually, you don't got one bus line, but that's gonna change because we are gonna extend it in this episode. So uh, let's uh, let's see what we are up to in this episode. I also, it's not it's not it's actually not that long ago that um, in terms of uh, how long it was uh, in between the episodes here. That's what I'm trying to say um, because we had plenty of millions to use. So I, you know what? Let's just make another episode right after the other one. Why not? Uh, because I got some ideas, and um, I think the, w the first one is uh, connecting Tau to Yopalan. Um Yeah, that's 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 something I want to do. Connecting Tau and Yopalan with maybe a bus route, maybe a tram line, something like that. And we are more than likely also going to make uh, probably a ferry line for Yopalan to uh, to Stavanger, because we need a port over here anyway for the materials, which is the second part. What we want to do I, I know i wanted to wait with this but you know what i think we are profitable enough to do it and i might as well take this last city and deal with it now instead of later i know it's not going to be the most profitable line in the world neither the buses or the ferries or probably the um, the material line but it doesn't matter we are in in a we are in a pretty good um, situation right now where we can we can de definitely take advantage of um, all pluses and Make sure we are completing a couple of things here. Also, save is <laughs> doing its job. So, um, what I'm thinking here is, if we if we uh, connect Yopalan to the rest, we are basically done over here. Sandnes, Stavanger, Yopalan, Tau, also Ukram, and uh, well, we're missing out on Haugesund, but that is five cities basically completed. Uh, I'm not going to go down and start with Buina Nordgård. No, I want to move further north, and we might even get to it this episode. We might want to connect these cities up here with the tram line that I was speaking about in the last episode and also connect it to Langevog. We might do that. We also have this city, Byrde, which I'm not sure what to do with yet, but um, it will probably be part of this scenario here. But for now, we're going to look at Jöpelan, and... We need to figure out if we want to do a tram line or a bus route here to connect it to Tau. Hmm, it's kind of a long route, isn't it? It's kind of a long... It's going to be a very beautiful route. This is going to be a very scenic route. I mean, who wouldn't like to live here? Who wouldn't like to live here? I mean, that's absolutely brilliant. Uh, I, I really don't know. I really don't know. I don't think trams would be that bad. Well, then again, we do not have trams in here right now, but we have our own we have our own bus line for Tau. If we then make a tram line that could long, run along the coastline here and just pick up uh, folks and just go back again, I don't mind that. It's 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 not bad. I you know, the more I think about it, the more I like a tram line here. Uh, and in that in, in in and in that case, we probably need to configure this one. Uh, do we need another plateau for that? Yeah, I think we're going to make another plateau for that. Uh, passenger, make uh, uh, electric. Do we need electric tram? No. I mean, I might as well just take it. It's probably not going to cost me that much more. Actually, how much more is it? Nothing. I guess it's the same. Uh, because we are going to get electric soon enough anyway, so I might as well just get it in. There we go. And then we need to go around actually upgrading all the roads here with the tool manager... Yeah, there we go. And it's it's, it's not going to be expensive at all. It's it's quite inexpensive actually. And uh, do I want to go? It, uh, I think I'm. Actually, it doesn't matter if it's going up or down. I think I'm just going to go l along the coast here as much as we can, and just go all the way over here to. Well, that's a long upgrade, but it did happen. All the way over to Yopalan, all the way in here. Probably run the circle here, and that should be good. I feel I feel like that's a really very very long route but also something i kind of like actually should we make another station mm, i don't i don't think so i think th i don't maybe we should because we do have probably a ferry going from maybe we should make uh, make use of that maybe we should make use of that hmm i don't know i don't know um well we will probably just have a stop near the ferry and that's about it and that's about it. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Actually, let's make sure we put plop in that um, 
that uh, we're probably going to make a car girl to begin with. And let's run. It's very hilly right here. I might want it down here, actually. This might be the place to club it in. But I do need a truck. Actually, I do need a truck station. So I might as well get the the ram, uh, tra rams, the, ra uh, the trams, <laughs> the trams to get down here as well. I might as well do it. Instead of going around in a loop. Yeah. Um, let's plump this in. Boom. That's in. Let's uh, actually right away when while we are at it. Get in a passenger line. Um, I, I should probably just... You know what? I should probably just get the bigger... It's not going to be that. Uh, it's probably going to be a small passenger route anyway. So yeah. I, f I think I'm fine with just a very small... We are never going to get something very sizable here into this uh, Yupalan here when it comes to passengers. So I think I'm good all the way through with just a small small passenger um, holding. Or what is it called? What, what are they actually called? Dock. Why? A dock. Um, and not the animal. <laughs> well, there we go. We probably need to get rid of some housing here. And that's fine. We can do that. Let's uh, find our building. We need... Take a truck station, 30 meters, no, it actually only needs to be 10 meters, I think. What else are we going to get in here? Mm, goods, yeah, I might, I might take 20 meters, why not? And I think I want it right on this side, but I need enough space to also have the tram line. So it's going to be quite expensive this, but yeah, uh, sure, go ahead, remove all buildings. I'm okay with that. Then we need some passenger line on the other side. Just I think two should do. Yeah, I think that's fine. Actually, we need uh, electric, please. Yes. There we go. It's, it doesn't actually cost anything to do that. That's actually interesting. I didn't. I didn't. Uh, maybe we want a very small tram line just for um, for Yupalan. <laughs> maybe I don't know. It's not. It's not out of the question. Just one tram running around this circle. Ah, probably not. Probably not worth it. Uh, what are we looking for? Wrong place. We need tools. We need to connect it. I think we're gonna get rid of these. I think we're not gonna go up there. And then again... And then again... Is this is this gonna take every residential area? Not really. But I think I'm okay with this. I think... I don't, I don't really need to go up here, do I? Nah. If people... If they can walk down here if they need that truck... Uh, the, the stop station. I'm I'm not gonna make a a longer route just because of these small houses up here. Nah. Nah. Not at all. There we go. That's cool. Now we just need a couple of stops along the route. Building bus and tram stops. Do we want them on either side? I think we do. I think we do. I think we do. So make a stop here and here. Make a stop probably around here and here. It's not gonna be that profitable, but you know what? It's gonna look kind of nice, isn't it? Especially when you're long, uh, running along it. And we probably want one... Probably just around here somewhere. And that should be fine. And then all the way down. Yeah, that should be good. Okay, let's make the route. So we're gonna start down here. And run it up here. Over to that one, that one, that one. And down to here. Back at this one, there, nine, and ten. There we go, it's a very long route, but I don't mind it. And it's not going to be profitable at all, but just having that connection in, I kind of like that. So this is going to be the Tau slash, what is it called over there? Yopalan. Yopalan. Good thing I have a... Naughty keyboard, huh? Your plan, and it is passenger dot trams. Well, trams or tram, I don't know. Just tram, actually. There we go. That is done, and we just need. Oh wait, do we have? Can I can I upgrade this to be? No, I can. I actually need to. Oh, wow, that's gonna be expensive <laughs> because there are not a lot of room anywhere. We need a, a depot. Uh, maybe here. Maybe here. 
There's no good options, are there? <laughs> no good options. Actually, maybe here. It's pretty flat here, isn't it? Yeah. We're going to take down a building for it, but it is what it is. Uh, where is it? Tram depot right here. Send it to Cartonary. I mean, we don't have... We don't use the Cartonary yet. Actually, did it build the Cartonary on the router? Mm. Yes, it did. I think it is in. But we don't have anything that actually works with it, but that's just future-proving uh, stuff. That is a lot of buildings to take out. That is 400. That's some really big buildings. Could we maybe find somewhere else that doesn't have that kind of a big building? But, whoa, well, it's going to be expensive. What about in here to the hillside? That's still going to be absolutely crazy expensive. But 200k? I mean... Jesus Christ, that is... I don't think we'll find anything better, do we? Unless it's on the hillside here with these small buildings, maybe. No, because of the hillside, it's going to be so expensive. Yeah, they can't even get in here because of the hillside. Wow. <laughs> I guess we're going to take it over here. It's, it's not going to look pretty. It's not going to be... I mean, it's going to be the least expensive one we can get over here. And getting rid of just two, three buildings. Mm. 230. Take it. It's not pretty, but it works. How many do we need? Ooh, uh, I don't know. Five. Four, five. Four hundred. Uh, let's start with uh, three. <laughs> They're expensive. Let's start with three. Uh, we, we will put more on it if they need it. Now, we can also make the ferry routes fairly easily, actually. So let's uh, just make that straight away. From here. For your plan to... I think it's just going to go to Stavanger. It's just going to be a very small route. It's not. It's nothing big. Just, uh, just a way, instead of they need to go all the way out to Tau, they can just go straight from Jupiland to Stavanger instead. Yeah, go ahead. Very odd uh, decision making here from the uh, <laughs> the logic making from the ships to go. Okay, fair enough. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna <laughs> go ahead and say it's wrong. But Jupiland uh, to Stavanger, cool, and that is passenger, and it is a ferry. So there we go. Cool. Done and dusted. We just need one to go in. We can build it over here. A Ricky? Yes, of course. And it's not going to be profitable, but again, it doesn't matter. We got we got plenty of cash income to make sure that we just get it in. Now to the thing that might be a little bit profitable is the Curie. See, this is going to be tricky because how are we going to get up there in the first place? I have absolutely... You know what? The first thing I want to do is actually plop again the truck station up here it can be it needs to be a 30 meters because otherwise it will just actually i'm not sure if it needs to be a 30 meters but yeah i'm gonna go for a 30 meters so we need we need to figure out how we're gonna get down i think we need to go down this way in this valley and then around the corner and probably down here somewhere it's gonna be tricky it's gonna be very expensive and it's gonna be very tricky Probably with a couple of tunnels. <laughs> uh, I think I'm going to take it right here. Or maybe. Yeah. In this hole. And make a small. Yeah, I think in this hole. If I plumb it in in this hole. I can probably make a connection to it. Somehow. And then go go via a tunnel. Into this small hillside here. I think that's probably the best way to go. Okay. Um, streets. This is going to be very. It's probably going to cost us a couple of millions to be honest. Uh, but it's a project I've been looking forward to. Can we, like, make a connection just up here? That's 118k. But you know what? I kind of like that tunnel system. I'll take it. And it also makes us sure that we have a connection now. And then we're going to make another tunnel in here. Probably that's going to cost another 100k. Wait, what? Why can I not make a... Okay, that's interesting. Can I make it go from here then? Okay, I can. Yeah, that's yeah, okay. Yeah, that's exactly what I wanted to see. But uh, it looks it looks kind of nice, isn't it? It is it, something you would see in Norway as well this. You you would probably see this in Norway. Going in a, into a tunnel and then straight out and then looking right and you have another tunnel and then just a small plateau of something. It is it is very Norwegian, isn't it? 
Uh, how the fuck are we gonna get down here? <laughs> I think we need to use the hillside to get around that corner or something like that. Probably something like that. Um, is that gonna do it? I think that's gonna be fine. Then use the hillside around. 67k, sure, take it. Use the hillside here. Small bridge. Actually, that that's really awesome. I kind of like that. That's uh, that looks perfect to me. Take it. Uh, bend it around the corner here. Going the opposite direction. We might. Yeah, that should be good. That should be good. See, th this is why it's not going to be profitable because it's going to be so hard to get it. And then we probably need to. Ooh, it's going to be hard. It's going to be so hard. I, I kind of want to hit this road down here. I'm just not sure how. What is what is going to happen if I just do this? I can't even do it. If you swing around, if you swing around this way, kind of, I'm going up this hill. Can I, like, get it to me somehow? Yes, I can. Wow. Honestly... That is kind of what I was looking for. And another small bridge, which uh, will make it look kind of nice. I'll take it. It's not going to be profitable because it's such a... But you know what? I kind of like it. I kind of like it. It's exactly what I was looking for. Or sort of. Sort of. And it's not It's not unlike what you would see in Norway. Especially not. It, especially not with a, a a couple of bridges over a cliff and then another bridge over a cliff and then going directly into two tunnels. It is it's like it's it's something you would see in Norway for sure. Um, but like I said, it's not going to be very profitable this route, and it doesn't need to be. Um, on the other hand, the the ferries running with the the stone materials and the um, well the stones and the construction materials will be probably more pro profitable. Uh, we probably need more cards on that route as well because we are plumping in another system here. Another system of... Wait, hold on. Actually, there's one thing I forgot to check out and that is where we are dropping off the materials. Maybe we don't need a drop-off point because mm -hmm. it is kind of... I guess, I guess the cards that's running back could take some with them. I guess they could take a bit with them and just drop it off right here or something like that. Just to get a little bit more out of the area. There's also some up here, but yeah. I think if we just make a single stop like here, it will take most of the... Actually, let's probably just drop them off. Drop them off like way over here. Replace existing. No, we don't want to do that. Just plop it off over here. Okay. Let's make the routes. Uh, we want to go from up here to down here then just make a small drop here drop off here just to make sure that it's getting more connected with the construction materials it doesn't really take a long time to just drop it off here that's pretty sweet and that is gonna be it's gonna be that's gonna be what is it your palan yes your palan stones and i guess also cons um yeah and that is Slash, well, that's not a slash. I'm not even sure what it's actually named that because it's not the same as the other one. It's, there is one, uh, yeah. I don't know. I'm I'm always using the long version of those two. I don't know why. I I, I mean, it's it, I think it's a think. I think it's something you use when you are actually in in writing when someone is thinking something. You you use that to like split up the two sentences, and then when it's going into this, it's like what they are thinking. But I I don't know. I, I might be wrong about that. Um, right, it is lorries. That is where we came from. <laughs> Lorry. Okay, that's good. That's done. Um, we do not have anything on it yet. Uh, I might need to... Yeah, it's going to be too expensive starting to build another depot, isn't it? Uh, I'm just going to use this depot over here. Just use this depot. Could we use these? I don't really want to use these, but... No, no I'm just going to use the other one. Just buy, I don't know, a couple, couple of them. I probably need like 20. Let's buy 20. Why not? It's a long route. It's not going to be profitable, but might as well get the, um, get the things out of it as we can. Where is your palan stones and cones right there? So this, yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure, really sure. I probably should have used another depot over here, but whatever. 
What else? Well, we need a ferry. No, we don't need a ferry. We need a ship. We need a ship. Did we build that ship route? No, we didn't. New line from here to right here. Very, very uh, small route, but yeah, it is what it is. It is what it is. And that's going to be Yopalan. Yopalan stones. Uh, actually the same as the other one, but just as a ship. There we go. And we can put one ship on that. I don't think we need more. And we we'll probably also want to do... Probably want to make sure that it is set to get full load. And it should not go anywhere in 10 minutes time. There we go. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Get that ship running. Damn. Done. That's your plan, done. Basically. You just need to, you know, make sure it, it runs smooth. Get a few more vehicles and stuff and maybe ships and whatever, what have you not in here. But other than that, we are uh, pretty much done in this area. Yubalan got two connections. Tau got two connections. Tavanga got two connections. Sadness got two unique connections. And so do Okram. Haugason is missing one connection. But uh, we're pretty much done in this area. We don't have any cities in here now. We're going to get these cities all in once in, in one go at some stage. Uh, but right now I want to continue the development of these cities right here. And then probably take these uh, with a ferry or something. Along with connecting them all together with maybe... Uh, I don't know. I don't know how we're going to connect all these in here. It's such a small place. Not going to be profitable, but whatever. And they're probably not going to get much um, industry as well. It's just going to be a you know small connection with one ferry or something going in there. Like it is in real life. If there is a small city... You probably won't have a lot of industry and stuff. Uh, okay. So that's done. That's all done. Now we need to think about what we want to do next. Well, we could continue with Haugesun and connect it to something else. But nah, I'm still thinking about making a train line going all the way up the coast here. At some stage. In the future when we have a ton of money. Right now, we are doing fine with the oil and all that. But yeah. Oh. This one is actually not having a SRAM. Did I forget to buy one or did I not put it on the line? I didn't put them on the line. Uh, put them on the line, please. There we go. It's very easy to see that you have forgot something if there is just a zero here. So uh, yeah, that's a good way to uh, remember that. But they are on the line now and they should work. Let's see them in action. Yes. And these, uh, tr what is it called? Tren 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 trenerary? The electric thing? Uh, we will definitely use that in the future when we are upgrading to the next. Uh, so we might as well just put it in now and have it have it done. And now that's the same way I'm doing with the cargoes here. When we do have enough money now, we might as well just plumb in the... Uh, actually, this is a small one because Yubilant don't need a big one. But uh, we, we, when we are making new ports and stuff, we're, we're doing the big stuff now. We need the big stuff. Um, because when we are getting new ships and tankers and stuff like that, ferries, we are going to go for the biggies. We're going to go for the biggies. Whoa, there's a lot of tools here. I think we need some more trucks on this line. We need some more trucks on this line because we are just... Oh yeah, that's well, it didn't work to begin with, Haugesson uh, delivery point. But now it does. We need a few more vehicles running it. Actually just plumb in five. How long is the route? Kind of long, but I think five should do. I think that's going to do. We could get materials materials into Haugesund, but we do not have a curry, so it would be a one-way ticket. So, nah. I'm still looking for profitable lines, first and foremost, when I'm uh, doing industries. And when it comes to the connections, it's, it's, it's all right if it's profitable, but it doesn't need to be. Um, hopefully, some of them are going to be like this Devanga Sandness passenger route here. 40k, that's, that's fine. And some of the ferries are probably also profitable, like this one. Okram and Stavanger is very profitable, 60k. In terms of passenger routes, that is very profitable, actually. Uh, but yeah, you, you you definitely need the industry to um, to make sure that... I mean, you could you can make... I have done maps where you have no industry and only passengers. It is insane hard, and it is pretty much impossible on a map like this, where there are so, many, so much hilliness... Um, I mean, it's. I, I'm not saying it's impossible, but it would be 
pretty insane to try and do it uh, because it would first of all you would need to run the, uh, run the speed um, the three speed for such a long time just to get enough money to make the next thing. So yeah, I think I think this game is hard enough as it is how we made it out with the Nor uh, Norwegian uh, uh, fields and uh, fjords and stuff like that. I think the game is hard enough for me here. I mean, I'm I'm doing quite well, so it's not okay. Never mind, never mind. Let's get into this. Okay, let's get into it. We need we need to do something here. We need to do something, not not just speak about what we uh, are considering hard. So I think I think we're gonna make this tram route, connecting all of these cities together with each other, making a, a central hub in here somewhere. But if I'm doing that, it would probably be advisable to have uh, like ferry station as well. I'm wondering if I should have the ferry station inside the fjord or out near the North Sea or out towards the North Sea. I mean, it's more likely we're going to have more ferries going this way than it is going inwards towards these small places. But yeah, um, I think I'm okay with building it on this side, actually. Having a ferry point right here that connects all of these to that point and then have all the trams connecting it to the ferry point. Along with the longer book. But further is kind of the on the fringe here because it's so far out. I don't know what to do with further. It will probably have its own little system of connections. Well that's for the future. That is for the future. It needs food and fuel, which is not too bad because we already are producing both those two things. But uh, not all of these, actually a lot of these places need food. We need to definitely, in the future, we will also, now I'm talking about the future again, instead of doing something. In the future, we will definitely make sure that right now, the the, the carts just can't, uh, we would have hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of carts on here, and it would still not, I mean, we could still not get all out of the farm that way. So uh, trains is probably the way to go. Maybe even ship routes in the future. Uh, going towards this one, or maybe another plant somewhere, I'm not sure. Uh, but we can get a lot more out of these and make a lot more food if we are um, making it more efficiently without the carts. Um, and I'm not saying that we are going completely away from the carts. We could just get some better versions, you know, some motorized things. And that could be the way to go and just getting a lot of trucks running in here. But ships might not be a bad thing. Ships might not be a bad thing. It's not the worst idea here. I, I like ships because the ships the ships are very constant in speed because, well, water is flat, basically. I mean, not really because it, there are, there are um, waves, but uh, not in this game. It, they just go by 25 kilometers an hour, at least the ships we have right now. So it's, it's, it's like they always go that speed and it's just a very easy way to make a profit. Um, yeah. And especially here in Norway, it's, 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 it's the way to go for now. So trains are not really in my mind for now. It's, it's very, it's a, it, trains are going to be something very expensive. And the carts are not going to pull enough uh, of, the, of the grain down towards the food um, processing plant. Is that a process? Yeah, it is actually called a processing plant. Fair enough. Yeah. So, yeah. we But that's, again, for the future. Let's focus on this tram situation here. I think this is not very central not a very central place for all all these five but it's kind of the best place to plumb in our yeah i, th I think it's gonna be and it's probably gonna um, the langevog along with moster and bremnes in the future will probably all be one city basically so i think we're just gonna plumb it in here it's gonna be a behemoth of a train station it's gonna be a bus train station um Probably also, uh, I actually think we need a lot of space. I might as well just go for three plateaus on both of them. Um, actually, hold on. I'm going to go with zero on one side. 30 meters, sure. Electric, yes, please. Because we are going to do trams here. Yeah, it's going to be very expensive. Uh, we actually need more than three lines, but I want them all on the same side. I want them all on the same side. Because on the other side, I will have, more than likely, I will have lines of um, cargo that is coming in with ships going out to all the city as well with food, fuel, um, whatever they need, actually. 
So again, planning ahead here, we are bringing in... I need it to be kind of like that. It's actually not that flat here, but... Uh, I don't really care. I think that is... I think maybe a little bit further over this to this towards this side. That is kind of okay for me. I'll take that. And I'm going to see how many do we need. We need one, two, three, four, five. So we need two more plateaus or, well, stations here going in. Make them just as big as the other ones. Three. There we go. That is pretty cool. That is pretty cool. Pretty expensive, but pretty cool. Uh, cargo. Nah, we're, gonna, we're not going to do that yet, but we got room for it on the other side now. Or maybe I should do it now just because... Nah. Nah, we don't need it. So we're going to have five different tram routes here. One to each city. One to each city. And some of them will probably... We need to make a, a bridge as well over here. Um, are we using this? Nah, we're probably never going to use this small fjord here. Nah, probably not. So we can easily make whatever kind of street connection we want here. Let's do it. Actually, why not use a large street? Because it is going to be a very place where there's going to be a lot of... Um, can we not connect that? Why? Collision? Okay. Okay, I guess we can... Maybe we can make it here. It's going to be expensive as hell. But maybe having it... Actually, I kind of like having it in the middle here. Because some of the trams are going to go to, to the right. Some of them are going to go to the left. So that's not a bad idea. Mm -mm -mm. We could also make it... I'm just wondering if I should do something else. Maybe I could... Oh, wait, hold on. I got, I got a brilliant idea here. It's a bit odd. But I think I'm going to make something a little bit crazy. Because we already have this lovely bridge right here. I am kind of in the idea of making an extra connection for Ferdi and actually make that a very long tram route. Making a very long... But that means I want to probably want to have another connection. I think I'm still going to make this one over here. More than likely, but I think I want another one. It's going to be very expensive, this, and it's not going to be profitable at all. But, you know, sometimes you just want to do things because you... Yeah, you want it. You just want it sometimes. <laughs> This is going to be quite expensive. Can't really say that it's not. I want to connect it like that, I think. And I think I'm going to raise it up a bit. I kind of don't like how it looks. Can we get another that? No, no. No, I don't like that. Remove that. I don't really like it. Hmm. Maybe here instead. A big, uh, it's going to be a bigger bridge, but I don't mind a bigger bridge. So like that. It's going to be a very flat bridge. Uh, that, that's way better. I kind of like that. Nothing can go under it, but I mean, I, I don't care about that. I just want it to look pretty decent. I think that's pretty cool. 300k. Um, sure, why not? Take it. And connect it up here, so the connection is a bit towards... Okay, that's fine. That is fine. It's going to be very odd having this. I've never done something like this before with this many. So it, that is going to be a, a hell of a long tram line if I'm going to do that. One hell of a long tram line. Can we like uh, upgrade here? Because I think I need a big route all the way going all the way through. Actually, I'm maybe going to let the city do it themselves. Take it here because why not? Because it doesn't cost a lot. But let's see. I could I could make like a loop. If I make another kind of bridge going this way and then over here and connect. I want to see how expensive it's going to be to make a bridge. Please don't do that. Make a bridge like going over here. If I even can do it, like... Can I get one over here like that? Collision. Okay. That is gonna be 800k. Are you... F yeah, that's, uh, that's maybe a little bit too much, isn't it? 
I could also... Ooh, you know what? I could make it this way. Or even... This way. That's only 300. I... Do... Like... That. Um, but I want to raise it up, because this is a place where there will go... Some ships under it. I don't think I needed to raise it more than that. Mm, no, that should be fine. That should be fine. 500k. I really like this bridge. And I like... That we would have an easy connection to Furde with um, trams. Um, that's kind of nice. And I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna yes, I'm gonna take it. It's it's so strange to do that, but it's uh it's it, it is what we're gonna do. I think we're gonna have um some tram lines that are how many I want one to Langvog, of course. I want one out to Bremnes. Then I want one out to Sakvog and Hariane. So that's three. And then a fourth that's going to Molster and to Furde and going back again. So we actually we only need four tram lines here, but some of them are gonna be some well. Freaking long tram lines. <laughs> we could also do something else. We could make it go around in circles, a uh, very, very big circles, and have this the end station, and then just two tram lines out to Langvog and Bremnes, and the rest is connected to each other by one circling tram line. But I'm not sure if I like that. I kind of like the idea of having a, a kind of a hop instead. Yeah. Kind of like that idea a whole lot more. Wow, this is going to be very interesting, but we're going to make sure that we are putting in our let's let's make it uh, let's make it now. Let's make it. This is going to take so long, but it's it's kind of interesting to me. And uh, we're going to put this one in. I guess we're going to use this line right here to get down there. Where we go? There we go. We are down there and we just need to upgrade that one in the future. Now we want into Bremnes, which is not going to be the whole whole lot of a big route here, but you know what, just make it go such, yeah, something like that, that should be fine. Small loop uh, for Bremnes, and then we need to use, I think we're going to go through the mid here and then cut in there, that should be fine. And I probably want to loop it like that. And I think I am going to make... I think I'm going to make more tram lines instead. Because it's going to be too... The, the, the tram lines are going to be too large or too long if I'm using more than... Yeah, I think I would just want more tram lines. I'm okay with just using more tram lines. So come back around. And then we need another one. Well, we need... <laughs> I don't know if I should make uh, this... Yeah, I probably should make the... Actually, delete that again and go around like this. Oh, man. It's just going to be so freaking big. I am... I, I, I'm still not... On, I'm still unsure how this is going to turn out. Still very unsure about it. But I feel like, actually, this is going to be a whole lot better. So, it is it is like a loop. But... Hmm... See, now I'm wondering if I should... Yeah, I... Oh, I'm, I got so many ideas about this. I got so many ideas. Hmm. I got so many ideas here. Hmm. Okay, that's fine. And then we need another route going over towards Furdy and Molster here. A Moster. Um, which we're gonna use this route right here for. I, this is this is gonna be one hell of a project, one hell of a long project. Um, hmm. Which way are we gonna go here? Probably just around the corner, then up here. So something like that is pretty good with me. That should be fine. That should be fine. Okay, so I think we're gonna make them individually here because otherwise I would get completely confused with myself if I uh, just plumped in 
uh, 40 odd post tram stops here. So we're going to make the long walk first, and that's going to be a very easy one to do. Uh, we're going to make a bus or tram stop right here. Might as well use them on either side. I feel like that's probably the best way to go. And one right here, and then one at this. So it's going to be a very easy route. We're going to make it right away. New line from here to here. Please, please take it. There we go. To here, to here. Wait, oops. Nope. We do not have... Um, we need to actually make that first. We need to make the passenger first. Can we get it in on this side? Yeah, we can. Wow. Interesting. Okay, cool. That's pretty nice. And uh, go back to the line management and at the station. There we go. Cool. That's in. Well, no. On the other way around, we are taking more passengers with us. There we go. That is going to be the Lange Vogue. Lange Vogue. Uh, well, passenger tram. Oops. Whoops. There we go. Done. Done. Is this uh this is a normal one, okay. We probably need a tram one in right next to it. We might as well put it in right now. We might as well put it in right now. Uh where is it? Right here. Turn it around, plumb it in, right next to the other one. Cool. And you know what? We can we can start with a one tram on each one. Longer road passenger, there we go. Good, 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 good. What else? Well, let's take the Bremnes first. Let's take that one. Get back to the... Is this going to be a one? Nah, probably two. Mm. Guess we can take a stop right here. Well, since it's... Yeah, we didn't actually need two connections there, did we? No, we didn't. Get rid of one of them. Let's get rid of one of them. And then we are going up here first and have a point up here. And then it's coming back down here. Actually, maybe we can have a, another one over here. Let's go with that. But it's not going to be a loop directly. Well, it is a loop, but whatever. New line from here to up here, here, and here. Yeah. So that's fine. That's another one. That is... What is that called? Bremnes. Bremnes passenger tram. Cool, cool, cool. So we are we're really we are plumbing them in now, but now is that was the two easy ones, I think. That was the two easy ones. Get it in. Get it going. And now comes the hard part. I think we're gonna make one. I I see I'm I'm wondering if, if I should just make one big one going in a loop. And then coming back to the Bremnes Halt, or our hop station. It's it's gonna be an absolute gigantic one. And we haven't, uh, you know what? I ha I don't think I actually upgraded over the bridge over here. Nah, nah. I'm gonna go around in the loops here and just make two large ones for. I mean these. I don't know. Should should they have one individually, or should they have be combined? These two be combined, and these two be combined. I kind of want one for each individually. I kind of want that, but it doesn't really make a lot of sense, does it? In the sense of, yeah, I think I'm gonna. Oh man, it's it's just it's just. Oh, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. You know what? I'm going to make them together. Yeah. New one from here to... Oh, we haven't made the stops. Well, probably need to do that first. But here's the thing. We got so much space here. We probably need to make a stop. Probably need a couple of stops. Buildings, please. Yeah, there we go. I probably want to stop here. And that is definitely going to be a two-stop situation. But the other ones are not, because it's a loop. So we are stopping right here. Then we are stopping... Oh man, this is going to be such a bad loop, man. It's just going to be such a bad time. We're stopping here. 
and down here, I think. Maybe actually over here, and then over here again. And then one last time around here, and then it's going back over the other side. That's um, that's a freaking big tram line, isn't it? But yeah, um, it's fine, hopefully. <laughs> So it's gonna go in that direction. Wow, this is a big one. It's, it's basically a train line, isn't it? Only nine stops, actually. Well, it's not that bad, but still, Jesus Christ! I should I prop sh I should probably have one going in the other direction as well. That might be how we're gonna do it, but I don't I don't I don't often see it being profitable doing that anyway, and it's not really needed, I don't think. So I think we're just gonna do that, and it's gonna be sack. Sakvok, Sakvok, slash, Hiani, or however you are spelling that, passenger tram. There we go. There we go. And I am, I'm considering all these cities to be kind of one city, uh, sort of. So when we put the ferries in here, all of them will have two unique kind of at least that is that is what I'm going for. They will have two unique connections because they will all be connected with trams and they will all be connected with a ferry anyway. So that is what I'm going for. Um, so I'm okay with this. And then we not we need the last one actually. Let's just get one of the trams in. Let's get it going. Sovak uh, Heinia. There we go. And new line. Last one. Uh, well, we can't make it yet because I didn't. Again, I, did, I forgot to build the passenger line. So where is this one? Probably need one connecting this kind of right here, and that could be. Oh yeah, this one is gonna be more uh, less of a loop actually than here. Maybe before the bridge as well. Maybe that was a bit too far off. Now that should be fine. And then one on the other side of the bridge maybe. Hmm, just before the bridge. Nah, just make it on the other side. Like, on the outskirts of the city. And then we do have a loop here. So we can build one on this side of the loop, and then one on the other side of the loop. I'm good with that. It's actually, yeah, it's a long route, but it doesn't have a lot of stops. So, at least we got that going for it. Oh, well, it do, it, actually, it will have a lot of stops, because it will go back and actually taking these stops again. Oh, out to save. Gonna have to wait for that. There's just no two ways about it. Would be terrible not having the outer safe, that's for sure. One day it's gonna crash. One day it's gonna crash, and then yeah, I'm gonna be so glad that I have outer safe on, don't I? So <laughs> But it's taking a long time. I gotta say the outer safe in this game is horrible. Uh kind of. And then going up here and here. Actually, is it that way? Yes, it is. Okay, good. I just had to check. Yeah, that is the way to go. Dropping here again, dropping off here again. So it's going to be nine drops as well. Okay, cool. And that is going to be called what? Mosterfjörde. Mosterfjörde. Moster slash fjörde. Fjörde passenger tram. Cool. So we th that took not as long as I thought it would. But uh, now we kind of need to connect them with a lot more than that tram. <laughs> a lot more than that tram. Wait, I didn't put it on the line. There we go. But at least they are all there now. So now all I need to do when I see a lot of passengers is just plopping in more trams. So that's cool. It's all connected. It's all connected. Now we just need it connected with a ferry as well. And I think we will do that... Mm. See, uh, I, I could make a ferry point in Langevog as well, but I think I, it, it would be more sensible to do it up here. Would be more sensible to do it here and then make it run down to maybe Haugesund and also Okram had two lines going. Could even make one going for Stavanger. We might want actually... It, it would not be too bad to make one go for Haugesund and then Stavanger and then back to Haugesund and back to... Long, um, well, this. What should we call it? I don't know what this area should be called, because it's it's like they are all built in together, except from Fjord. Fjord is like on the outskirts here, but 
it, it's probably going to be one of the it, it, it's not going to be one city so to speak but it's going to be one of the most populated areas for sure uh, right I don't know I don't know what to do let's make a port let's make a port because I, I do want that ferry line in here in this episode now nah, I, I can probably make that outside the episode I, th I think the episode is long enough long enough as it is and I think we've got a lot done here just connecting all these um, now they just need to make a profit. Uh, no, they're not going to make a profit, are they? And I also need to probably build a lot more ships on these routes mm -hmm. over here because 200... Yeah. You know what? Let's just do that right away because they are already making a profit. We need like double the amount of ships here. Double. At least double. One, two, three for that one. Let's take the other route. They probably need four. One, two, three, four... Cool. This one probably need one more, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, yeah, I'd probably do. Plenty of tools. Plenty of tools down here. Yeah, it's like, does it? Does it now? I mean, I could easily do... Yeah, let's give it one more. Let's give it one more. Especially with just uh, us putting in double the amount of ships on the other route. We might probably want one more on that one as well. But that's, that's something I can do in between episodes. That is something I'm just letting the game run and... You know, doing stuff like that. We're in 1882, but we are starting to connect a lot of cities now. Um, and that's that's pretty cool. Um, that's pretty cool. It actually didn't take as long as I thought this would be. Uh, which is nice. We don't, lo we don't see a lot of people yet because we don't have that ferry connection. When we do get that ferry connection... Actually, let's just do it now. Let's do it now. I think, I think it will... I think it will go crazy. I think we need more than one port here. So I'm going to make two straight away. Two big ones straight away. Um, yeah, yeah, I'm cool with this. I'm cool with this. And we're going to connect it directly up to the... Uh, so they can just walk up there. But it's a bit annoying. Actually, could I take advantage of getting the water in there? It's a bit longer for the ships to go around. The, but I think it's going to be cooler like this. It's going to cost 800k. Uh, we can afford that. Can't we? Take it. Take it. So the people can walk directly into the port here and up to this central hub. I'm gonna call this central hub. This is gonna be central city hub. Yeah. Central city hub. Whoops. Please take capital right here for city. So this area I'm gonna name is central city. Um, it, It's not central at all. It's, it's basically really far to the north in in the southern part of Norway. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it's it's central in terms of where I think a lot of the people in this game is going to start developing. I mean, there are so many cities here and they could all develop. I mean, so something like Bremnes here got plenty of space. Uh, Sakvo got plenty of space. Hynia got plenty of space. Fjord got plenty of space. Even Langvog actually still got a lot here. So yeah, I think there's going to be a lot of people in this area. So um, yeah. Yeah, that should be cool. Okay. We can just make uh, the roofs directly here, I think. Um I'm still I'm still kind of uh, not sure where maybe we just want wanna make one route down to Haugesund. That that is connecting them up to the rest of them. Or maybe it would be better to go for Okham. Connecting Okham and the central city. Yeah. I think I think Haugesund is probably not it, it's gonna be like an outskirts city. I mean, it is quite quite big, but I think I think Okham is gonna be bigger. I don't know, but I kind of want to connect it to Okham instead of the uh, this small hub here. I mean, I don't. Let's let's actually just connect it to Haugesund. I mean, I'm yeah, I'm I'm reconsidering myself all the time here, or I, I can't make up my mind on what what to do. Um, but uh, yeah, sure. Let's uh, let's go for this. Yeah, and, and also, this already got plenty of connections. So, let's connect it to Haugesund, why not? Haugesund is also a big city already, so there we go. That should work already. We just need to plump in a ship. Ricky. I, I kind of want to go for something bigger here, actually. kind of want to go for something bigger. If that's the case, I will need a bigger uh, shipyard over here. Or a bigger, um, bigger plateau. 
Yeah, but yeah, I'm gonna go for the big one. I'm gonna go for the big one. It, it's probably not gonna be profitable at all. It's line one. We need to change that name, of course. But first, we are gonna need to configure this into a passenger. Yeah, let's take it like that. I'm cool with that. Make sure we got a landing. And also the lines. Wait, hold on. That line should go on managed lines. Should go on port one. Also, otherwise it can't. Oh, it actually, it, 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 wow. That was a big one. <laughs> well, it actually looks quite nice. That looks quite nice. It's okay, it's okay, and it, it's probably the same thing I would do in the future, so... It's it's all good, it's all good. Okay, so that should work. Let's... Oh, wow, this big ship. That is... Very nice. Oh, I love this model. I really love this model. So I guess we can uh, end the episode by just following... This little... Uh, wow, it's looking so good. I really... Especially with the reds down in the water, it looks so great. Man, I like this one. Okay, well, I'm gonna leave you with this, and, um, well, well, you can watch for a couple of, uh, I mean, I'm probably gonna let it run for, yeah, you know, probably 30 seconds or so before the uh, outro is gonna go, so, see you around, lads.